Time once again for our offensive update of the week. My guest this week is offensive lineman Jamal Covington. Jamal, certainly good for myself and the 49ers faithful to see you back in uniform. Just tell oh, me yeah. kind of how the recovery process has gone and uh, how it feels to be back out on the field. It feels great to be out, be back out here. Uh, hats off to the training staff, AJ and Justin and everyone involved in that training staff. They've been doing everything they can and I've been doing everything on my part to try to get back as soon as possible. And here I am, I'm here. Well, now that you're back too, just kind of tell me what's kind of the game plan that you guys have been working on in practice and what's kind of been the message to you guys to help you be mentally and physically ready for Old Dominion? Uh, really just really comes down to execution. One of the things we've really, well, that I've really learned from uh, being a part of a FBS program moving up to that next level is the margin of error is very small. We got to eliminate those little mistakes and execute on game day. One thing we know about from talking to Old Dominion sources throughout the week and throughout the year has been they provide a great home atmosphere. As the road team, what can you guys do as players to kind of block out the noise that you're going to be hearing on Saturday and just focus on the game? Uh, really lean on each other and uh, just be a brother's keeper and know that we have each other's back on and off the field. So whatever happens, uh, we know that we got each other's back. The coaches have our backs and we have their backs as well. So we really feel like that's going to help us out on Saturday. Give me a couple keys to the game, too, that you think are going to be really important to make sure the execution is the best it can be. Uh, we really want to be physical up front and be the toughest football team out on the field. So 